From the Cruise Radio Studio in Jacksonville, Florida, this is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. Good morning. Here's your cruise news for Tuesday, June 7th. It's not goodbye, but so long for now. Well, also goodbye as well. After sailing from Port Canaveral for the past 11 years, Disney Dream has left Central Florida for Miami. This move comes just before Disney Wish makes her debut at the end of this month. Starting today, Disney Dream will sail three, four, and five night cruises from South Florida, calling to either the Bahamas or the Western Caribbean, depending on the length of the itinerary. Disney Fantasy, she'll remain in Port Canaveral while Disney Magic does a med season and Wonder sails Alaska. And as multiple cruise lines complete their fleet restarts in quick succession, Seabourn has been added to that list. The luxury cruise line's fifth and final ship, Seabourn Sojourn, set sail from Piraeus on Monday. This summer, Seabourn has three ships in the Mediterranean, one in Northern Europe and one in Alaska. The line's first expedition ship, Seabourn Venture, is scheduled to debut next month. And this is an interesting story. Some passengers had a rough start to their vacation last week when a cage of luggage was dropped overboard during embarkation. Guests were boarding p ship Ventura in Southampton on Saturday when a luggage cage was accidentally dropped into the water. A lifeboat was dispatched to grab the cage, which likely held around 20 suitcases. The cruise line offered compensation and services for the soaked luggage. In cruise line stocks were all up 1% on Monday. Carnival Corporation 13.61, Royal Caribbean 56.80, and Norwegian 15.75. Breaking news and industry coverage at cruiseradio.net. Back here in Jacksonville for a little while, I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today. Have a great Tuesday. Cruise News Today is a production of Cruise Radio. For daily updates, subscribe to the Cruise Radio YouTube channel or visit cruiseradio.net.